A lot of recession modelling is very simple. It's probate modelling based on a couple of variables, one of which usually is the slope of the yield curve. Another one is the, um, the ratio of corporate po profitability to, to, to wage income. So simple. And what you get is a, a, a probability estimate of recession. Okay, so at the moment, let's say those models are saying 20% probability of recession. But what they don't tell you, or they don't give you a lot of information about, is the timing of recession. So what we've got is a tool where we've got a whole list of indicators. I think there's 24 different indicators. And each one of those indicators, so the first one, for example, is US truck sales. Each indicator has a, has, a, has, a, has a a threshold level, and if the data print is through the threshold level, you get a, you get a warning flash, basically. You're saying recession's approaching. But each indicator has a best fit, if you like, of time to recession. So this first one, US truck sales, when it goes through the threshold and you get the warning flash going off, it's an indicator that recession's about 24 months away. And then you work down the list of indicators and you know, as you get closer to recession, more of these go through the threshold and you can, you can, you know, you can see what the likely timing is um, between now and, and, and recession based on it. And so at the moment we've got about 6 out of 24 indicators that are that are flashing warning and it's all the ones at the top and it's so it's, it's sort of saying that recessions between 18 and 24 months away